Hello, this is Tamara Weeks with Tam's Daily Vlog. This is my very first progress report for my 30-piece wardrobe capsule. That is 30 pieces of clothing for spring and summer, 30 pieces of clothing for fall and winter. So 60 pieces total. That sounds like a lot of clothes unless you have like four or five times that many in your closet when you get started. So this is my very first progress report. I am super, super excited and I cannot wait to give you the next progress report. Thank you so much for being here with me during this progress. Let me hear in the comments below if you have a capsule wardrobe, what you're doing with your clothes, and what you think about the progress that I've made. I'll talk to you soon. This is a baker's rack that I have in my room that was completely full of stuff. Only this shelf and this shelf were completely full of clothes, but I've completely emptied it out as we go through this process of getting a capsule wardrobe. So I have moved out the baker's rack out of this room, and I know this room looks awful. We're working on it. It's just taking a really long time. But before I do anything else, I want to show you the closet. Okay, so there's a shelf right there. And we're planning on putting a rack up there. And then maybe I can put the winter things there. So what I've done is just sort of, um, I've weeded out just a ton. So I brought all the winter jackets in here. I hung up all my skirts in here. These are all my sweaters. I have several of these. They, they hang right here. And then you put hangers right here, hangers in the back, and then you can you can fold them up and they're space savers. But I just leave them down so that I can see them. So I have more skirts over here. Maybe a few more I can pull out that are summer. Over here, I've always kept my dresses. So I have a couple more of the winter jackets over here. A lot of the, the, well, I guess almost every single summer dress I have is still hanging in here. So this is still a ton of clothes. It is way more than uh, 60 items, 30 per, per season. These are just a few of my scarves. I don't wear them because I can't get to them and I don't think about them, etc. Right down here is a container with more of my scarves and then there are two shelves up there that I keep a few things. This is my computer bag to travel with. These are things that need mending. This is a sweater that I love that I'm going to fix but maybe we're going to get rid of it because we are trying to downscale. Okay so right here I have a couple of things that are micas that need to be mended. A couple of things here I'm going to try on and see if maybe I can do without these things. I have taken a lot out of here. This was completely full and I've emptied it almost completely. Right here we have the pile of giveaway clothes and I have one, two, three bags that Lauren might want to look through and find something that she wants. So this has been a really big process, but it has been really fun once I finally felt like I had some direction that I talked about in the last video. So I'm going to have to wait until the clothes and the wash get washed and dried and I can take a look because I think those are all my core pieces because I needed something to wear with what I'm wearing right now and I ended up with a with a red shirt that doesn't really match. I'm trying to keep it all covered up because everything that would match this is in the wash right now. So I have to wait on that and then sort of wear things. Like I looked in the mirror at the scarf that I'm wearing today and there are two giant snags on this. So I'll go ahead and wear this through the rest of the winter and then I'll evaluate whether I'm gonna throw it out and not wear it and wear it next fall and winter. This is kind of warm, so it's really a, a, a winter, not really a fall. So I'm really excited about the progress that I've made about the direction. I really feel like I have some direction, 
and I have um, oh let me go show you the uh, the whole closet and show you what I did in there okay so this is the whole closet these are summer things and this is one of those hangers that I showed you I have like a whole bunch of them that my pastor's wife gave me okay so it's a hanger and and this this piece right here is folded up and it snaps there's one one in the front and one one in the back and I've already taken off some of the shirts that I put on here but these are all summer and then right back here I have like the um, the special items you know that you don't wear very often the wedding special occasion things now I do have a few shirts here and I'm gonna find a different place to put them for our um, we have a missions Sunday every Sunday at every Sorry, I'm trying to talk and show you this stuff at the same time. We have a mission Sunday every month, and I have missions clothes, and I always forget to wear them. Okay, so up here at the top, I put all the summer suits and the summer jackets, and as you see, we are way beyond 30 pieces for winter or for, um, for summer here. But I've got most of the summer separated into here so this is just a step at a time what I've seen on videos what they tell you to do is you put um, take everything out of your closet all at one time that is absolutely not going to work for me because that means that you have to have a space that you can leave all your clothes or it means that you're gonna do this like in one or two days and I just don't have any place to put all my clothes so I, my very first step was to go through and pick out all the things that absolutely don't fit right, don't look right. There's something wrong with them, even if it's something that I'm currently wearing. So that was the very first step that I did, and then I just have gone through multiple times and weeded out, and I have to wait on the wash. So this is the progress that I'm super excited about. I'm going to put a link, a couple of links below for my, to my friend Phoebe, who lives in Canada. She is one of my viewers and we have decided to do this together to clean out spaces in our house. So mine right now is the closet and hers is her art area. And she is a beautiful artist and makes great videos to show her art. And she also has a cat named Soma and Soma loves to be in her videos. So I'm going to link that below. Hello Phoebe, I am so excited about the progress that we have already made and I'm super excited about doing this together. At the end of the year, we are going to have super clean houses. Thank you so much for watching Tamara Weeks with Tam's Daily Vlog. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.